I have finally received my graduation present. And for graduation, I wanted a new laptop. So my parents were like, sure, go ahead, pick it out, get whatever computer you want, we'll pay for it, just pick it out. And therein lies the rub, pick it out, Lauren. Now, this was not an easy purchase for me to make. When I graduated back in June, my parents were like, okay, sweet, you get a new laptop for graduation. Yeah, woo, awesome. And I was all like, yeah, woo, awesome. But then I was like, oh, so now I have to pick out a new laptop. I had my Apple fanboy friends on one camp saying, you know, MacBook Pro, MacBook Pro, it's awesome. You're creative, you need a MacBook Pro. You edit videos, you need a MacBook Pro. Then I had my more developer type friends on the other hand that are like, no, uh, it's an overpriced BTU box and you need to get yourself a PC because Macs are just elitist status symbols, blah, 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 blah. And I was like, okay, that makes sense too. And so I did a lot of research, like a lot. I cruised CNET for hours and hours and hours. It was kind of like my go-to procrastination activity. Like, oh, what am I gonna do right now? I'm supposed to be doing work. Oh, I'm supposed to be writing about the news. Let's go over to read some laptop reviews. And I did, lots. And I came to the conclusion eventually that MacBooks are awesome, really, really awesome. But PCs are really awesome too. Now, I grew up with Macs, Mac desktops in my house, and I love them for image and video editing stations. They're awesome, they're great. And you know, it's a really simple, user-friendly, um, uh, graphical user interface and everything. Like, I, I like Macs, but I'm a PC. As soon as I started getting my own computers in university, I became a PC, and I've never looked back. I love Windows 7. I love it a lot more than the Mac OS. I just find that if you're someone who likes to tinker with things, if you are a real techie, then it's kind of more the way to go. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't mean to offend any of my Mac using techies because you can be a techie using play around with things. I just, I like, I like Windows. I like Windows and I think that it's a bit smarter. So, yeah, I went with a Dell because I've always had Dells. I got my first Dell in my first year of university. I got my second one a couple years later, right before I went to Sweden. And get this, when I got there and blew the battery out by plugging it into some faulty, stupid electric, electric adapter thing, um, Dell sent me a brand new one. Like, just like that. They're like, yep, like it was my fault that I effed up the battery and they still sent me a new one and that kind of impressed me. I've always had excellent customer service from them and um, they're good machines, what can I say? They're not as sleek and sexy as a MacBook Pro, but they're good. Um, so this is my old laptop. She will be going to the Electronic Waste Recycling Depot very shortly, in a couple of days after I get everything off of her. I've put most things onto my, uh, my big old external hard drive already, but yeah. Here she is. Um, it's got a little bit, of, a little sticker there from Cornify.com, uh, serving you rainbows and unicorns and sparkles since I don't know when, but it rock. Um, I got that at RaffleCon, and I have had this on the back for a long time. I forget what symbol that is. It's some like skateboarding company, but people are always like, "Woo, sweet laptop! What kind is it?" And I'm like, "Dude, it's the devil with a sticker on it." Duh. So um, yeah. She's in rough shape though. I've had her, like I said, since I got back, since I went to Sweden. So it's been like two and a half years now. And that's kind of old for a laptop. So I'm going to show you some things here. Um, I ripped these keys off like an awesome champion at an airport when I was frustrated one time. Um, because the flight attendant kept coming and telling me to shut my, my laptop. And she was like, shut your laptop, man, shut your laptop. And I, I was like trying to send something out and the Wi-Fi was being wonky and I was just like, we were taking off soon and, and I had to get this thing out, this document before we left. And I was like, shut your laptop! And I flipped it off. Ask uh, Friction Walsh about that story. He was sitting next to me and was like so unimpressed, obviously, because he's probably like, this chick is nuts. Um, anyways, so that's, uh, that's Barbie too. I call her Barbie 2 because the first doll I got was Barbie 1. And now we're about to go downstairs and open up Barbie 3 to meet her for the first time. And I think um, I, she's powerful. She's a powerful little puppy. That's for dang sure. But I think you're going to be impressed by how beautiful she is too. Wait and see. 
Hi, I'm Lauren O'Nizzle, and I'm about to unbox my brand new doll. Yours is here. Yes, it is. Mine is here. Finally. So, it says on this side, me. Congrats on your master's degree. Enjoy. I love you, mom and dad. Because I got this for graduation. It only took me like two months to choose which one to get, but I've made the decision. I pimped her to the max. I custom put uh, how much? I think six gigs of RAM, a terabyte of storage, um, an i7 processor, obviously. So let's do this. I'm gonna uh, open her up. And this isn't a true unboxing because my little brother opened it before I got home to get it. But that's okay because he's a developer. So it's sort of like a doctor seeing you naked. It doesn't really count. Okay. She's birthing. Come on, push. <laughs> Is that what it sounds like when people give birth, Mom? No, not quite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Okay, ma'am. We'll wipe you with the cool cloth. That's good. Now to deliver the placenta. <laughs> My mom's like, oh, what the heck? Did I raise? Okay. Here it is. Oh. My new doll. Oh, she's huge. 17 inches because this is a desktop replacement for me. Uh, large and lovely. Ooh, in flamingo pink. Look at her. Look Sorry at if I turn this? Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, no, because then people will go see. Okay. That's good. Look at her. Oh, take off that sleeve. Oh, she is big. Oh, that's the smell of new electronic. I'm just going to wear that as a cape for a little while. Look at that flamingo pink. Oh, that's flamingo beautiful. Pink. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my gosh. Almost red. It's huge. It's almost red. It's a nice, beautiful sunset yeah. color. I think the charger. Oh, we got key muffs in here. So this is the Dell Studio 17. Uh, six gigs of RAM, a terabyte of storage. Um, I have some processor, like I said. Really good graphics card. I forget what it's called, which one it is. There's like a million now. Um, Here's the, I don't know, the stuff that comes with it. I got Windows 7, obviously. I'm going to put Photoshop and um, Premiere and Illustrator and all my good tools on there. Maybe even Flash. Take that, Steve Jobs. That's right. I'm going to do some Flash developing on my PC. And, uh, yeah, so here's the other stuff that goes with it. But that's kind of boring. But let's look at the goods. Here. Um, I'll take over now, Mom. Thanks for filming. This is, can I show you? No. She says no. Beautiful. Um, it's got a backlit keyboard. Uh, let's see the Cute. let's see the side there. I feel, I feel like a por like a pornographer right now. I'm like, oh, getting up close in her nasty bit. That's huge. It is huge. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> I really feel like a pornographer now. This is my mom. No, it isn't. Oh. So you got the headphone jack. You got the. Oh, is that a card reader? I thought that maybe I had one. Maybe this. No, I don't know. Whatever. HDMI cable. Nice. Um, let's see where the USB ports is at. Where my ports is at. There's where the uh, power goes, I think, right there. Oh, gosh. You can't even see this. Oh, nice. And little speakers or something. I don't know. No USB is at the back. Not at the back. No. There, well, there's one here. There's, this is one. Oh, here. There's two on this side. I thought there's one over here. Yeah, there's one over there too. Yeah. Look at my mom. She even knows where USB port is. She's so smart. Right. Oh, and there's here's a. Oh, oh my yeah. gosh. Look, there's a card reader. A card reader, right? In, okay. Yeah, it's not a real one. No, it's not a card, but this is a card reader. Yeah, mine has that. Vision. Yours has that too? Mm -hmm. That's awesome. I had an external card reader. Now I can just insert cards in there. This is amazing. Oh, it's light too. It's, it's not that heavy. Here, you lift it up. Oh. Sorry. Okay. Here, lift it up, Mom. And let me see. Oh, see, my mom can lift it. It must be very light. Yeah, ha, ha. Pink, lovely, beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. That's, that's gorgeous. A, that's a nice little doll. Look at how shiny that screen is. I hope it doesn't hold fingerprints. I guess only time will tell. Mm, thanks for watching. My mom's rolling her eyes at me. She's like, this kid, how did she get to be such a camera hog? How did she get to be such a camera hog? Mm, love you.